Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I am going to be showing you guys and talking about all of my favourite hair care products. So this is both for me to use on myself and also for me to use on my clients aka my mother. So yeah I hope you guys do enjoy today's video. Don't forget to smash your thumbs up. Also subscribe if you haven't already and let's just get on to the video. that don't know I am a trainee hairdresser um, uh, this is my third year and I'm potentially going to go on to my fourth it's depending um, if I don't go on to my fourth I will just go straight into um, doing clients and stuff like that I do clients on my free time but as you all know I don't have a lot of free time therefore most of my clients are actually family but I do a lot of clients in with college to pass assessments and stuff like that so these are things that maybe similar things that I would use on clients and with college and also clients out with college um, that I have in my free time. So the first product that I have been absolutely loving is the Swatch Goff Gliss Hair Repair Liquid Silk. Now this is an express repair conditioner so any leave-in conditioner I absolutely love for clients especially if they're maybe bleached hair or quite frizzy hair. I really really love this because it helps it stop it tangling as much and just giving that smooth finish for them. So this is the product here, it is relatively cheap, um, it's obviously cheaper if you've got places like B&M and stuff which is where I got this one, um, but yeah I absolutely love it, just make sure they obviously give it a good shake and Swatch Goff obviously recommend this to people that have coloured their hair as well because you're prone to more breakages and stuff like that so I really really enjoy this product on clients and as I said if your fr hair's frizzy or if you've been bleaching it or whatever and I spray this on and then dry it um, obviously it goes on when the hair is damp and then dry it the hair is so nice and silky it is just it is literally a miracle in the bottle so next up is again by Swatch Goff and this is the got to be beach matte texture salt spray so I really enjoy this more into summer times when even myself is wanting to maybe do more waves or just wanting more of that textured hair or my client is wanting more of texture in their hair um, or if I'm going to do a little pin up obviously I don't want to be using something that's going to make it really silky because otherwise I'm not going to have full control over the hair therefore I like to use this um, just so I've got more grip and again if I'm maybe wanting a little bit more texture in my hair or if the client is wanting it just blow dried but a little bit more texture then this is a really good product that I like to use and then just getting the last swatch goth item out of the way this is the got to be glued blasting freeze spray so I absolutely love Love this hairspray it is amazing like amazing with a capital A if you haven't tried this hairspray then you really really need to it is just amazing as I said it is so I say cheap because obviously again you can get it in places like B&M and Home Bargains and stuff like that so you get it cheaper but it is definitely worth the price whatever you pay for it if you are struggling as well to keep curls and stuff in then definitely use this because it is just again it's again another miracle in a bottle and I would always recommend this hairspray as well to my clients. So then you might want a looser hold or you might want feel like that the hairspray kind of makes the hair more matte then I really like the Lee Stafford shine spray. I just give the style a quick once over. Nothing too crazy because I've already set it with my hairspray or I'm only wanting a small amount of holds then I will use this because it just works as a treat. Obviously as you guys know normal hairspray can just make it like hard or brittle or um, look really really matte so I like to give it a little once over with this Lee Stafford shine spray and it just brings the style back to life. So next up I've got this little nourishing hair serum now this is a by Avon but I love a good hair serum in the salon in college we use the Wella Oil Reflections which is really really nice as well um, just any hair serum any hair oil the oil reflections is for more after you can put it on damp hair as well um, and you put that 
that on after so say you do nice curls or even straighten someone's hair put it through and it adds a little bit of shine this nice gorgeous hair serum will do that as well but you put this on damp hair not dry hair you just put it through the midlines to ends not touching the root because it's oils and um, midlines and ends and then once you finish styling the hair it's nice and silky and yeah all of these products just go together as well i really like playing around with styling products i feel like using a few different styling products really get me far and i love my styling products i actually can't do a client without them so then my next one is the beauty works heat protection just a heat protector that will work I absolutely love this Beauty Works one, the bottle is massive as well and again I love using this on myself, it just helps as like so much because if you don't know I have virgin hair, I have a natural hair, no colour, nothing in it and obviously I'm wanting to keep it as healthy as possible so I love a good heat protector and I feel like this is just a must have for any clients even if I don't want to be adding any texturising sprays or any leave-in conditioners or anything like that then I will always make sure that I use a heat protector even if I'm just working on a mannequin head I always use a heat protector because I want the hair to last the hair needs to last and we need to protect it i am going to be doing a video very very soon on why you should be using heat protector you've probably seen it around on tiktok i'm going to put it to the test where you spray this on bread on half of the bread put it in the toaster and see how it comes out and i'm also going to be telling you guys a little bit more information about heat protector as well as obviously showing you that little trick so yeah definitely stay tuned for that but a heat protector is a must have if you don't want any oils or as I said any leave-in conditioners or um, ocean sprays or anything like that then just make sure you have a heat protector and the last one again if I don't feel like using a particular product on my client or even myself I like to just use a little 10 in 1 spray because it just it just helps the hair so obviously it does have a heat protector but I like to give it a good double layer so on the bottle it just says things like it protects it from heat and it frizz moisturizing glosses it and shines it, prevents split ends, strengthens hair. It's got loads of different claims, a 10 in 1 spray, which is absolutely amazing. And that's why I like to just give this good ones over in my hair um, if I'm not wanting to use any particular product. So that is the end of today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy. Don't forget to smash a big thumbs up and also subscribe if you haven't already. If you get any other video ideas, then please drop them down below. Don't need to be hairdressing related, just any videos in general, because I want to give you guys what you want. But yeah, as I said, I hope you guys did enjoy and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!